You know what I like to do sometimes? I like to look at some baseball cards. You know I like to look at some baseball cards. I, uh, I'm wearing a glove again for this one. This is a true, you know, one of those cards, extra special cards, I think. And I want to show it to you, um, and I don't want you to look at the, uh, the grade, so I'm not going to show you the grade. I want you to take a look at that card. I want you to appreciate the card. The Yogi Berra Rookie Card, 1948 Bowman, and I'm going to show you the other cards I have from this set. But I just want you to appreciate that card for what it is. And you know, this is what I don't like about grading personally. You can have a card that you absolutely love and you decide you're gonna send it in for grading and then you get it back and you're disappointed in the grade. And I see it on here all the time, guys getting cards back and they're disappointed. You know, a card that you loved, you now are disappointed at every time you look at it. And that's the one thing I really don't like about grading because this is a beautiful, beautiful example of this card. And there's your grade. It's a 2.5. whoop de hoo Love the card. Love it just the same as if it was a 7. So that's uh, my Yogi Berra rookie. Here's my Ralph Kiner rookie. Here's an Eddie Juiced. And this is just a really cool looking card. Great card. Here's a Bob Feller. A Johnny Scene autograph card. Love this one. Here's a Ool Blackwell, and this is his rookie card. I believe it's a short print. And I have a Bill Rigney. And a Mikoski. And this card's just great. I don't know what it is about this. This card has great eye appeal to me. Especially for a black and white card. So, let's take another look at this beautiful 1948 Yogi Berra rookie. One of the greatest catchers in baseball history. Thanks for watching.